When the University of Georgia's football team is done on the field, they leave some damage behind. Local Boutique Community brings their focus of sustainable fashion, locally made products, and alterations to the playing field. They're very rough on their jerseys, so um, every game there's something that comes in, like very small holes to very big tears. And For 13 years, Community has brought sustainable fashion and alterations to Athens, Georgia. This fall marks their fifth season working with Georgia football. Each week, they receive a set of damaged jerseys and their seamstresses repair them. This can be patching up a hole or adding a patch. Repairing the football jerseys doesn't just make them last longer, it changes what the jersey means, making it more than just a number. I think it's also a neat element that by repairing the jerseys every week, they really become more special and valuable um, because they really show like the battle scars of the games. It's almost like a memory map. Repairing jerseys is also beneficial for the environment. When clothing is made of synthetic fibers and is discarded, it can end up in oceans and bodies of water, releasing microplastics into the environment and the organisms that consume them. By repairing the jerseys, fewer textiles are discarded and fewer textiles are needed to replace the damaged jerseys. When it comes to sportswear, I don't think that synthetic fabrics are necessarily bad because you have to also consider the function of the sportswear. So I think there are ways that designers and brands and companies who are creating sportswear can consider the types of fabrics that they're using and if those are easily mended and if those can easily be recycled and reused. The seamstresses behind the stitches at Community are doing their part to keep Georgia football jerseys in the cycle of wear. In Athens, Georgia, for Grady News Source, I'm Sophie Ralph.